guys, it's John Brantley Cole, Film Guy John. Sorry about this crazy angle. Uh, I have to put my phone in a place where it's safe for me to drive and talk to you guys without getting into an accident. But anyway, I am on my way to CBS Radford Studios. It is a studio with tons of little studios on it that TV shows and movies film their shows on uh, here in Studio City. I booked a TV show called Better With You on ABC. It's a sitcom, a three-camera sitcom. Uh, three cameras that come, for those who don't know, means that generally it's live and uh, there are three cameras always running at the same time when uh, they're taping. And what they do is they cut from camera to camera or they edit it later on uh, to make sure that they have all the angles. Unlike other shows like one hour dramas or movies where there's a single camera and what they do is they independently do each individual angle uh, at a time which takes a lot longer. Um, so today is a three camera. This is my second three camera show. I think my last one was uh, Accidentally on Purpose starring Jenna Elfman. That was a cool little shoot when I was a little bit heavier. And um, now it's going to be fun. It's a two day shoot. So today is going to be a dry run day, I guess. It's like a rehearsal. We're going to rehearse it, do wardrobe, do last minute changes. And then tomorrow, which happens to be my birthday, uh, tomorrow, um, we're going to do live audience. So that's going to be a very cool, cool gift to me. Um, I earned it, right? I auditioned. Uh, so, uh, uh, on my birthday, I get to be on set with a nice audience, great cast and do a show. That's awesome. But anyway, uh, um, my birthday. Yeah. I usually don't celebrate birthdays. Uh, but this year I think I, I will. I mean, not big, like a big party or anything, but I'm going to let people, uh, say happy birthday to me. <laughs> so, uh, my first birthday gift I got so far this year were these really awesome, phenomenal shoes called G Defiers or Gravity Defy or G Defy or G Defy. I don't know. I'll, here, right under here. This is what they're called. Um, uh, my friends and cohorts at Extreme Burn, uh, Vaughn and Brandy bought these for me, I think a week, week and a half, uh, two weeks ago, uh, like a pre-birthday gift. And it was awesome because basically I jump higher, I move faster, there's less pain in my legs because there's these little springs in the heels, little springs in the heels. So it's very cool, very cool. Uh, and then I treated myself to a nice big flat screen LED 3D television. Um, well, I guess I didn't. Visa uh, cards uh, treated me. Um, hopefully, uh, I'll pay back Visa someday. <laughs> so... Um, um, I bought myself and treated myself to a television, and uh, then um, I got a TV show. So, and then this weekend I'm hanging with friends, uh, which I usually, you know, I may go out for dinner or something. But you know, I'm I'm happy. This year has been a good year. This and last year has been a great year for me. So anyway, enough of my personal life. I am slowly going to drive on to CBS Radford now. Of course, because I want to respect the privacy of the studios and the shows. Uh, I may or may not be able to show anything or everything. It really depends. So um, we'll see what happens because you never know. The biggest thing about this that I is a downfall. I don't know if it's a downfall. Is that uh, my dogs, my poor dogs. I don't live in a house. I live in a condo. So I don't know how long I'm going to be gone because sometimes these shoots could be two hours or rehearsals or, or recordings could be two hours or they could be uh, 12 hours and so my poor dogs uh, you know they don't get fed on time they don't get walked on time they don't get play time they don't get anything because I don't know the schedule and I can't drop them off at doggy daycare because I don't know when I'm gonna be done because they don't really know the studios don't know so so my dogs I just gave them a nice big walk I fed them uh, I left the TV on. Uh, hopefully, you know, they won't get too bored. Uh, and I am approaching CBS Radford Studios. I wish I could show you. Maybe I'll find a picture online and I'll insert it. And what they told me... Oh, shit. Where's my wallet? I forgot my wallet. Here it is. Better with you? Okay, she'll take care of you. All the way up. All right, thank you. Uh, I thought I left my wallet at home. That would have been bad. 
They always need your wallet. Um, they don't need your wallet, they need your ID. Passport, social security card, all that stuff for payroll. But I think I might actually be on the payroll for the studios because of my password, but I'm not sure. Let me see. Hello? Better with you? No. Building 23? You said go to the left parking structure to the fourth floor? Or above. Or above. All right. Thank you so much. All right. You too. For the show, this is my dressing room. Let's see what it looks like. <clears throat> Let me see here. My dressing room consists of a shower and a bathroom and a toilet and a couch. I think that's it. And a closet. Now, the only problem with this is that there is no internet. No television, no cell service, and I don't read. So what am I supposed to do? I can't go on my phone. I guess I can play games. Um, sorry about that. I had to cut off the camera. Uh, another actor suddenly barged into my dressing room. She thought it was her room. It's kind of funny, um, but um, no. So. <clears throat> I'm just going to fill out contracts, read my script, um, play games on my phone. I don't know what else am I going to do. Because um, I could be here for hours till it's time for me, to my rehearsal, to my scene. Um, hmm. I don't know. I don't know what to do. But I will figure it out. I'll probably go to craft services, get some food. That's it. I wish there was a television here. You know what? I forgot to bring DVDs. I always bring DVDs and today's the one day I forget. But anyway, excuse me. Um, I am going to um, get cracking and finding something to do. You know what, maybe I have a uh, turbo music class that I'm teaching Friday. Maybe I will go through the routine in my dressing room. Ho hopefully no one will barge in while I'm doing it. All right, I'll talk to you later. Hey guys, I just finished lunch and I was watching some rehearsals and now I'm just going to go back to sleep and wait until it's my turn to be on set. Um, they have the extras all 
sitting on the bleachers, I believe, and all the cast members are back here in their dressing rooms. So I can't. I kind of like hanging out with the extras because I at least have someone to talk to. Uh, generally, when um, you have your own dressing room, it's pretty quiet, which is probably pretty nice when you're a series regular and you just want to get away from everyone. But <clears throat> since there's no TV, no internet, no phone service here, I can't really do anything. So I'm just going to take another nap until they need me on set. So good night. Yep, that's it. Good night. All right. We just finished doing a run through of the entire show. Very funny, very cute. It's a um, old school family live action comedy. Um, so now I am heading home. I get to relax. And then tomorrow I am back at CBS Radford. Man, I look tired. Um, I'll probably go home, hit the gym, and then um, rest and enjoy. Because tomorrow is shooting and my birthday. Sorry I couldn't get more footage, but I'll try to get some tomorrow. All right? Ciao.